Uh, all right. Day two of this madness. Better. Um. Um. Use a shoe. Here's a book. Here's another book. African history, I don't need to learn that. Unless I'm learning tactics on how to make like spears and shit like that. That that'd be very useful. Bite coin. Okay. Oh. Out in the bayou. What's this? this Oh, no. Cure some sickness. No, that's okay. Dragon bar. Feel the dragon's breath. Dovekin. That's what I'm talking about. K bar. It's supposed to be a K bar. It says National Guard, not but it's really K bar. Day, this is day two, so <laughs> that's, that's, that's always what the new game's gonna be like. You have to sprint. Hang on, I just realised. Did they actually leave me a bow? Just where they leave the bow. You know, I'll go over there where the target was. There might be a bow there. Explore this area. Let's grab one now. Ooh, what's this? Sage. One of the seven or one of a kind can't be scrapped. I was gonna scrap it anyway. I'm not simpleton. You scraps collectibles. I mean, he says special. What more? What more can you need? Or? Well, clearly, I can't go back there. So let's go over where that bullseye is. I mean, hopefully. I mean, this is generally helping me like getting used to the controls. What's this? One of set up one of a kind can we go yeah. Civil bow. Aha Pretty cool. Shaft. Let's try out this bad boy. That was way off. Um. Sensor. <sighs> Just... 
Yeah. Um. Oh, good stab ya, you bastard. Fucking ship ya. Vodka for those who hate the taste of vodka. How the hell does that make sense? See if I can actually make a bow. Silent but deadly. <laughs> My child, what do you expect? Uh, all right, all right, well, you know. Don't know how you upgrade this shit, but. Ooh, I never. That's not cool. Don't be breathing down my neck. It's anyway, all this shit. <sighs> right. What's involved? I don't, I don't need to do that. I'm very confident. <laughs> Keep one bottle on me. You never know. Ah. I'm wasting daylight, but uh, mush. But that's how you're moving the um, onslaught, moving your side, hand side to side. I was, honestly, I was expecting us to get that game before we got this game. Hopefully, that other game will be good. Two good walking dead games. Um, touchy touchy. <sighs> but now, yeah, I mean, like, so far, I am I'm liking this. I'm like, I mean, obviously, I've only killed like what two walkers, or oh, two roamers and lurkers. If you get more of the linger, biters. If you're I don't think about it. I don't know if he actually is called them biters in the comic. Mm. Was all, I, all I remember they're the same zombies and lurkers and roamers. I don't remember them saying. Mm -hmm. Okay, now. Sure, I sent to myself. Hmm. Over here, please. Un momento. Over here. Be careful. There's walkers around. I don't see any. I have no one else to turn to. My husband, he's turned. He begged me not to let it happen. But I just couldn't pull the trigger. He was all I had left. But I failed him. I, I'm so ashamed. Would you be willing to help me out? I just can't bring myself to do it. I need someone else to end this nightmare.
Oh, I, I feel generous. I will put him to rest. You will? Thank you. That is so kind. Here, take this key. I locked Ruben in a room. Second floor of the Blue Mansion. Just up the street. I noticed your watch. Looks like you've got the alarm in sync with the chiming bells that rile up the walkers every day. Smart. Don't want to be caught out in the open when this place is overrun by the dead. Oh, and um, one last request. Ruben's wedding band. If you could retrieve it, it would mean so much to me. At least I could carry one small token with me. From my children. I have nothing. They're just gone. I never even got to say goodbye. All right, fine, fine. Anyway, back there. Some, sometimes they can be quite crafty with their collectibles. Quite tense. It feel like I'm in the comic. It's just like, ooh. Another shoe. Can I? No. Uh, anything over here? I truly have to search every nook and cranny. Alright. Oh, that's a shame. I wonder how long is this set in the apocalypse? Because it's... It's got to be... At least... Probably where the prison is, probably a bit further than that, I don't know. Uh, people who read the comic will know about this. Obviously, spoilers of the comic at the um, the prison. Basically, the governor. There's a thing. This spoon with the governor. See you. Basically, involves getting a spoon in your eye. I mean, obviously, it was up his ass before then. See, the, 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 I liked what I liked about the comic. It was more graphic. I know how to dispatch walkers. Go through. Oh, over here first, I've seen some shit on the ground. Can I? Nah. Okay, it's a random plunk. Broken revolver, don't mind if I do. 
voodoo color. They're really going with that voodoo, aren't they? What's this? Um, what am I supposed to? Why isn't that a grab? <laughs> Get out the fuck out of here. I know it's backtracking, but go around. So just to make sure, explore everything. Oh dear. Didn't realize there was stamina. Looking at my overall stamina has gone down. Turner from King of the Sea. Yeah, I have no idea how satisfying it is. Just, just grab some ass, grab um, a zombie skull, and just uh, grab a head and just jam a knife in him. Just so satisfying. Now is not the time to be selfish. Now is the time to commit to a community, to be part of something. Our vision for the future is rooted in hope. It ensures a future for humanity. Cast despair aside. There is no point in clinging to it. Do not commit to isolation. Dedicate yourself to a grander purpose. And you will not be alone. Trust in us to guide you. And we will put our trust in you. Within our walls, you will be safe. Within our walls, your needs will be met. Within our walls, but that will collapse. life goes on. The tower will always stand. See, <laughs> See the thing is... All right. With me, I watched a lot of zombie games, a lot of zombie movies, probably most of them. I've read the books, and I've seen a lot of like other things. What, what human race is really like, and to be honest, it is much safer to just be on your own. If the shit goes down, you're not gonna like. Ideally, you don't want to hang out with people, because what happens? The government says, "Oh, let's go to these spots." Hello. Go to these, um... I want them on a pizza. The, the government will tell you, oh, let's, let's... Let's hurl up everyone together in these refugee camps and shit like that. But all it takes is one person, one dickhead, to hide a bite. Or, as this case, hide like a heart attack or... Or have heart conditions and shit like that and he'll hide that. Because then they would like no idea that person will then turn or selfish person commit suicide because they can't take the pressure and then they end up turning and coming back to life and then biting and then obviously the entire 
entire like place gets overrun with the dead inside. Maybe Noir is a traitor. Maybe Noir is a liar and a thief. She will say and do anything to further her own selfish agenda. Do not be fooled. She will not help you. She will corrupt you. I considered her family. Treated her as if she were my own flesh and blood. Yet she did not hesitate to betray me. She tried to turn my dearest and most loyal friends against me. Oh, her treachery knows no bounds. She is desperate and will do the same to you. Do not be fooled. Maybe Noir is a menace. She should be shunned. If you assist her in any way, you will leave us no choice but to consider you an enemy of the tower. We do not wish this. Do not force our hand. The tower will always stand. Mama. Bitch can try. I do the fuck I want. If I want to end up, you know, how is the one? Fucking that's the one. Anyway, what I was talking about. Oh yeah. See, so obviously, like I was saying, when the chips go, when basically, if you're with people, people will start to obviously hide shit in. A lot of guys will probably want to be the alpha male. Some say they don't, but you know, it's biologically we want to be the alpha. Like, I am alpha. Like that. Uh, the, uh, most guys want to be in control, want to be in charge. So obviously, if. Obviously, if another guy's taking over, it's like, no, I want to take orders from you. <laughs> So, but yeah, so essentially, that's what you don't want. I mean, obviously, I've, I've, I just realised these day actually here, you don't know. So, <laughs> shouldn't really be talking, but uh, I just, I just like putting my two cents in it, just like the fact is, storage full. Anyway, yes, yes, come over here. But as I said, with most people, they tend to, they would hide, like I said, the men will try and be the alpha male, they want to like take over, whilst, well, I know, obviously, the, I mean, yeah, obviously, you could say, Most, most people want to be the alpha. Most guys want to be the alpha male. They don't want to take orders from anyone.
Oh. Ah, so that was bad. The scraps. Uh, let's see. What's this? Um, the book, man, heats it. Either way. Sister, that matches. in here. Is that? Oh, that's a dead ball. Yeah, man. Took about a lot of six. Sure. All right. Let's see, what can I get rid of? Let's see, what does the dog about do? Um, see, okay, now. Uh, I need a shoe. I need the shoe. All right. I need the pillow. That's why I just shoot the pillow. Matches. Let's see. Yeah. This. See now, this. This is important. Right, so I'll just put that there for now. Cigarette packet. I want the spoon. Uh, let's 
Nice wood shavings that would be good for fingers. Um, oh, battles all over the place. Make sure there's nothing there. Raises sharp objects. Seriously, I want to get rid of all this. <laughs> There's so much shit I want to pick up. So that'd be useful for the um, Rick's revolver. Oh. <sighs> but I'm probably making some stupid decisions here, but I can't help it. Overall, how is it? What's this? Anti sept medical tape. Uh, I know, I know. Oh, sick. Okay, okay, okay. What can I get rid of? Kitchen, no. no. Oh, can I? <laughs> there. Sorry, my friend. I feel so short in this. Why do, I f Why do I feel so short? Glue. What's this? More glue. This is really annoying. Dirty bandages. What oh, dirty ass bandages? What's this? The holy fucking Bible, son. Back, back the devils. Yeah, that's not gonna work. He's Oh, what was that? Shafts, antiseptics, and. Uh. Uh, Antisex is. is, is, is <laughs> yeah. Shoe. Adhesives, wooden scrap bindings. Do. Shut up. Um, matches, razors. Dirty bandages. That's gonna kick me in the ass later, but I don't care. What's this? More glue. This is all I wanted to do. I just wanted to explore houses, gather supplies. This is all I wanted to do in a Walking Dead game. What's this? Packs. 
I'm British uh, facts means another thing. Well, I've got two handed weapon at least. Everyone wants graphs. It'd be even better, I can put it on my head, but I can't. Come over here, mate. Medicine. Um, I want collectibles. That's one of my thumbnails I'm going to be using. See, so that's the thing, you know, I'm going to be using thumbnails for this. Kids, to make some. Funny shit, don't they? My dad's got one of those clocks. But yeah, I'm going to be using thumbnails for this series, so. I'm trying to actually you know do a form now a unique form now for all of them but that's gotta be a pain in the ass try and muster King blue everywhere to go along then I Uh, 
Hello. Hello. Anyone here? Hello. Hello. Sorry, my friend. My dearest Korean, I lied to you. I am sorry. I had to spare you. I lost hope. Our children died by my hand. I had to set them free to protect them from a fate worse than death. I know you will never be able to forgive me, but maybe one day, you will understand that I had no choice. They did not suffer. Take comfort in that, my love. Ruben. Where's the ring? No, Jedi, shit, we're Jedi, where the ring? Where did the, the ring go?
Johnny calls you a fucking thing. Alright. Everywhere. Some medication. That from the I better get out of here.
Five. Two. We need medicine. But safe to be on the ground. As I said it away, with me I would never be a part of a group. Because I find groups, as I said, they end up, someone end up betraying you or someone end up fucking it for the rest of us. Okay, this is a horde event. I'm getting, I'm making sure I'm getting everything.
Intense. I didn't fail that mission. Whew. 
obviously there was a um, while I was in the car the recording obviously stopped because I can only record for one hour at a time so I may have oh this is gonna be <sighs> try and be a, a a video and a half for eventually day two Whew. the state of this So over here would be the Walking Dead memorabilia items. So the spoon that took dug out the governor's eye will be there. Over here will be the statues of an angels. Let me do that. Um, over here would be medicine. Technically, memorabilia. Myself a new pillow. All right, I just start. Box of stuff. Glue. Box of stuff. Matches. Poseidon mm -hmm. mm -hmm. tuna. I just fiber and protein, so I can make something of like that. Um, so it's glue. It's hard to get ahead of nowadays. <laughs> Mwah. Tuna Pascal, do not collect two hundred dollars. Yeah. Shotgun. Get one of those. Occasional pack of smokes. Sterile ones. Wow, actually, still alive. Be precious. Mm. Well done.
See what I'm going to find. Scrap materials with grab guns. Workable. Good old Lucille. Nutrition. Nutrition. Yeah. Alright. That's going to be the end of day two, I think it is. Yes, day two. So. I made sure got my medication. You shush. Got my medication. Got my supplies. There, yeah, my meds. Got my walking dead memorabilia there. Got my pillar. So that'd be the end. Well, right. gonna We cannot be afraid to ignite our passions. Hello? Even in the midst of the nightmare. No. It is precisely then when the nightmare's claws are digging into the thin flesh of our fading hope that we must defy the nightmare and live. Truly live. And make no mistake, mere survival is not living. Scrounging for crumbs like a timid field mouse begging some simpleton who bumbled away into the role of heartless dictator for guidance? <laughs> Not me. I choose to embrace everything that makes me human. 
I choose to carve my own way through this new world. I am not a lowly animal. I should not be acting like one. Humor me for a moment while I recount an old bio legend. Many of you listening will no doubt recall the campfire tale of Charlie Boy, who met his end at the hands of the Sukiyon at the Bogachita Swamp. But a lesser known Charlie Boy tale is what I will regale you with now. As a youth, Charlie Boy was not one to adhere to rules. In fact, you could say the young lad was a bit of a miscreant. Thieving, vandalizing, terrorizing. Mischief was in his blood. And mischief is what made the man. On a sweltering summer's eve, one of those Nola nights when the air was so thick and hot a dragonfly could barely get airborne, Charlie Boy set out from his home in the 17th Ward and skulked on over to the Garden District with revenge thumping in his chest. His family had been wronged by some rich folk landlord types who were scheming to get Charlie Boy and his family evicted for no good reason at all. Now, Charlie Boy knew there wasn't much he could do being just a 12-year-old beanpole, but he was not about to sit idly by and let old money greed ruin his family without landing a counterpunch. So out of chicken wire, Charlie Boy molded a huge head and put an old Pulcinella mask on it. The nose stretching down to the chin. He painted the whole thing black as night. With the head on his shoulders, Charlie Boy stood a gangly seven feet tall. A messenger from the underworld. When he found the mansion of his oppressors, midnight about to strike, he slipped over the back of... My arm's stuck. Help! Beautiful day ahead of me. Tomorrow I'm gonna to return that ring and hopefully I can get more supplies because that's a really fucked up you were there. So I will see you all in day three.